Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. It is I, DC Gaming. And today we're playing uh, Rogue Legacy. No, it's a game I've played a lot in my spare time. I think I've played over nine hours of the game so far, and it's been hilarious. It's been fun. So we have three... So how Rogue Legacy works is that you have a bunch of heirs. It's essentially a family tree trying to take out one castle. Now each of your heirs have... So or each heir special in their own way. For example, this is an Archimage. Oh, see... I've played a lot of it, so I've upgraded a lot of the characters. This guy would start off as a mage, but you upgrade him to an archmage. Yeah, so archmages... A mage can only have one spell, archmages can have multiple spells that they scroll through. And each one has their own, like, special effect. This is a barbarian queen, and there's barbarian kings, but they start off as the normal barbarian, which you then upgrade to barbarian kings and queens. Which means they have the fo their special is a foos, is basically having dragon shout. But they call it Barbarian Shout. And it just and it says Fall Road and whenever you press when you use your special, it yells Fall Road Dust instead of Fus Roda. Now, let's talk about the genetics. There's hypergonadism, which means you're permaroided. Enemies knock back or attack knocks enemies back further. And then there's straight baldness, the bald and the beautiful. You have a spell which is dagger, which is just shoot a dagger directly in front of you. And then there's Sir McLattery the Fourth, the Act Mage. He has ectomorph and hypergonadism. Ectomorph is that you're so skinny every hit sends you flying. And hypergonadism is permaroid and attacks knock your enemies further. Then there's the Archmage, this one, who's Sir Darwin the Third. He's a powerful spellcaster and every kill gives you mana. He has a spell cycle and he has dextrocardia. Your mana and HP pools are swapped, who knew? And and nostalgic, you miss the good old days. I think we're gonna go with this one. Oh no, he's got like less I didn't make much money last run, so essentially which you generally want... Uh, what spells do I have? I have Time Stop, a Chakram, which throws it directly in front of you like this. I, I don't have anything special. Then there's Time Stop. And then there's the Scythe. So this guy, the Charon, will take your money and go inside the castle. You can upgrade your uh, capabilities of bartering with him. <laughs> Reminiscing. You can upgrade your capabilities of bartering with him, bartering with him to... Haggling with him, in a sense. To make you pay less and less each run. Yeah, you run very slow because it's the olden days. As you are known to do. Also, Archmages aren't very fast. Uh, mages have never been known for running. The advantage of Archmage, just mages in general, is the fact they deal huge amounts. Yeah, everything is like in weird slow mo. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to do that. But. Oh, no. Mages are decent, I guess. Yeah. This is just the entire game, it's just this like really nice world. So the entire plot of the game is that you're in cast there's um roughly around five. Bastard, get over there! You crazy bastard! Honestly. So I I occasionally swear as a Scottish person, even though I'm not of Scottish descent, I just do it because it's fun. Don't judge me. I know some of you out there are judging me and calling me a weeaboo. I don't want to be Scottish, I'm just saying that. I've actually chosen... Oh my god, I just realized I've made the tankiest mage ever. Because normally the mages are supposed to have 118 health and 285 mana. So this is the tankiest mage I've ever made. That This might be good. This could work out well. Hey, Chadite. Get over there. Yeah, everything kind of moves slower when you're in a nostalgic mode. Because it's like an old tiny picture film. Right, I have a double, and there's also these runes that you can use to upgrade yourself. So I have the runes that are like gold gain up, so I get ten percent more gold. So usually I'm supposed to only get um, about roughly like ten gold. Oh uh, no, that's literally impossible for me. That is literally impossible. Hold, on. Hold the jumper! Alright, so there's four areas and you have to kill all... There's five areas and you have to kill all five bosses to, um... To essentially advance to the final boss. This is one of those such areas. 
Yeah, Chakram's a pretty good spell, because it does that. It does the thing where it just kind of hovers, and it just deals 60 amount of damage per shot. It's like every time it hits the guy, well, at least for mages, it, again, it varies very heavily. These are the... Get Rector. Ta-ta! Shit. I got hit. But then again, I have like over 200 health. I think I have more health than a uh, Barb... No, Barbarians have slightly more than me, I'm pretty sure. I think they have like 290. Yeah, there's a lot of cool classes. I have unlocked... I think I've unlocked all of them. There might be more. The thing is, you generally want to upgrade your manor. Yeah, these guys are... I thought... They look intimidating, but not really. You just gotta cut again to like their Spear of Influence. Oh, shit. I'm running in there. No. Well, screw it. I'm the tankiest Archmage you've ever seen, girl. I will not be stopped. Cannot. Can't. Cannot. Can't. Can't. Isn't it can't, can't stop, won't stop? I think, yeah. It's can't stop, won't stop. I'm old. At least I think I'm old. I think I was born in the wrong time. I think I would have been better in the 80s. Honestly, I think I would have been better in the 80s. Like, my skills... Of just referencing things would have been more useful to the world in the 80s or the 90s. Hey, hey, Chain Tour. Alright, let us go. Oh, Ninjos, prepare to get reckled. Yeah, there, a lot of these names are puns. And it looks like I just freed that worgen. Oh, I'm also off to this. I think we're going to record Hearthstone. I figured I'd talk a little bit about why I've been away. I don't know if any of you have read the thing. I've just kind of been... Depressed is too harsh of a word. I wasn't very depressed. I was just kind of burned out in a sense. It sounds like I was like, oh yeah, I was going through some hard times. Well, not necessarily. I was just very burnt. Oh, fuck it. Shit, that, that, that thing's far up. Yeah, this thing is like constant and far up. I'll just... Let me see what's up here. Oh, looty loot. Looty loot, looty loot, loot. I love me some loot. I think we'll wait for the next one. Alright. Looty loot, 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 loot. Ooh, a blueprint. I need those, actually. Silver chest plate. That should do me well. Come on, Archmage. I'm going to call him Archmage Antonidas. Come on, Arch Archmage. Archmage Antonidas. Let's go. Archmage Antonidas is, uh, is the Archmage in World of Warcraft. Hey, Dirk Face. Don't you fucking do that shit. Hey, have, have, have fun with that. Yeah, enjoy that. It was just for you. Hey, guys, enjoy that. Enjoy that, you know, fucking chakram. Hey jerks, you want to you want to line up, please? Can you please line up? That's right, guard. I have another one. Hmm, that was a bit too expensive on the mana. So dextrocardia for mage is good and bad. I've learned. Ah, oh, great pyrites. I can't tell because of the fact there's it's a nostalgic mode. Hey jerk face! Oh shit! Yeah, oh, damn it. There. Taste of my chakram. Hata. Oh god. I don't want to die, but I need to fight. Oh, there's a chest up here. Screw these guys. I'm just gonna go get that chest. Yeah, I'm only gonna do more or less one life. Let's see how far we can... Another blueprint. That's good. That's good. I need these. Ranger home. I haven't actually found a blueprint in a very long time. This is my first time I found a blueprint in, like, so long. Back! I'm a servant of the light. Yeah, but I think I'm gonna go back into Hearthstone and talk, a, show you a little bit, because the Black Run Mountain, like expansion, is coming out soon. So I'm gonna try storing up gold for that, because I'm not gonna pay money for it, because Blizzard's not getting my money that easily. Blizzard is not getting my money that easily. All right, you know you wanna fire that salvo, buddy, Sunny Jim. That's a lot of gold, gold. I need to take out this guy. Yeah. Hey, Jerk. 
You know you wanna you wanna step you wanna jump? You wanna fight, bruh? These guys aren't they're they're dangerous in a way. On their own, not really, but they can kinda push you in a corner. They're just they're 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 weird. They're a weird enemy. They're just you might be thinking, why don't you just go in the next room? Well, generally, you don't want to do that. You want to kill everyone you can on this. You want to clear rooms because you might need to make a hasty retreat. And you don't want to have to, for whatever reason, have to fight through anything. Also, you want the gold. You want to get as much gold as you can. Ah, that's a decent amount of health. Yeah, also these journal entries that kind of tell you how to play the game. Now, I'll start reading. <clears throat> Princess Journal, Journal Entry 15. I remember uh, everyone's English. Screw it. It's fine. It's fine if they're English. I remember a fa being a famous adventurer. My martial proudness surpassed all of my brothers that I'm sure of. While they spent their days buried in their bookish studies, I was out killing brigands and monsters. I always wondered why my father favored them or me. Isn't uh, isn't it always the opposite in fairy tales? Fortune favors the bold, but not the insipid intellectual, or something like that. Man, I would love to to see my brothers try to think. To try to outthink my sword in their face. Jeez. Yeah, the prince is very weird. He's a very spiteful character. I don't know. He, the reason why these print you find these notes around here is from a guy that was the, that is here previously before you. How you get out of here? I think I'm done with this place. Fortune favors the bold, and not the insipid intellectual. Hmm. I suppose. I can see why he's jealous. He's the first boar. Oh, shit. He is the first born, after all, but apparently his father, the king, favors them over him. Probably because of the fact they're just general. Oh, shit. Nope. <laughs> There's no fall damage in this game, so screw you. Nope. I'm not good. Not dealing with that. F of that noise. Well, then that was not my brightest of plans. I'm just gonna step down here. Hey, Jerk Face! Shit, which are these guys? Oh, it's these guys. Okay, that's fine. There's like, I can't tell because it's weirdly colored. But, well, now I know it's a rage! I should be safe here. I'm not gonna waste my mana on that. I'm not gonna waste my mana to kill him. I'm just gonna steve him. He gets steved. But, um, I definitely recommend. It's a very bright game. Well, fuck. Well, I suppose that ends that life. So ends the tale of Sir Darwin the Third. He is who hath been slain by a hawk guard, and he gives you. Well, he did a fair job, I have to say. He did a pretty good job. It also tells you how good they did. Like by with their names, like this guy was stout, but he made me a lot of gold. Yeah, here's an example of some of the other characters. There's a lich, which how the lich works is that um he kills. For every kill he gets, he gains more max health. But he starts off with a very low health. And he can't do huge amounts of damage. For every kill he gets, he consecutively gets more base health. He doesn't gain health, but his health bar grows from her killing. Then there is the miner, which gets is very low health, very low mana pool. This guy also has a very low mana pool. So he can't cast a lot of, they can't cast a lot of spells. But they get a lot of gold. There's the Arc Mage. There's the Hokage, which is the evolved version of the um, the evolved version of the Shinobi, which are ninjas. They do they move fast, they jump higher, and they deal huge amounts of damage, but they can't crit. Now the assassins is the upgraded version of the uh, the knave. Now knaves have low stats, low low health, and low attack. But the advantage of them is that they have a very high chance of critting. And that's pretty much it. That's all the people I have in the game. There might be more. Oh, yes, there's also the Paladin. But as I said earlier, he's fairly... I don't know if I said this earlier. But he's the generic hero. He's good at everything, basically. And he has a shield, which makes him block attacks for 25... For, for 25 mana, you can block an attack. So it's just kind of... Yeah, he's just a really good tank. That's pretty much it. Yeah, here's people with, with Vertigo. Powerful spellcaster, every kill, get blah, blah, blah. Vertigo, which means you're upside down. And then this guy's bald, this guy also has vertical, and I think I'm gonna have to get... Honestly, I've tried playing this game with vertigo, it's fucking impossible for me. If you guys can do it, please go ahead. 
But Lady Chun Li the tenth, I've had really good luck with the Chun Li's. <laughs> but the thing is, everything close up is blurry. It's just kind of. Mm. Thing is, it's really weird to play the game upside down. So I think I'm just gonna have to go with this one. And I hope you guys have a fantastic day. This is just game DCS gaming signing out. I only told you guys I was only gonna do one of these, and I'm gonna continue that tradition. However, I will, however, buy that new thing. Yet yeah, look, look how weird it is. So your hair is gonna be like constantly blurry. So I guess that'd be weird. Hmm. I liked it all. Let's see. Yeah, we got a sheer upgrade on the silver chest. 25 armor. Uh, that's pretty good. Yeah, if you can see, I have 353 health with a... Oh yeah, I have two blueprints. I better check out the other one was, because I don't actually remember. I don't really want... I don't, I don't have enough money for runes anyway. What was the other thing I got? Do you guys remember? Because I don't. Let's see, I don't, I don't have a new sword. Oh yeah, helmet. A ranger helm. What does that do? More health, less mana, plus more, better armor. Okay. Well, that's fair enough. Oh jeez, this guy. Oh yeah, this the enchant. This, oh, I should probably explain what these guys are. That's the smithy. He makes you weapons and armor. This is the enchantress. She has runes. You find runes in the dungeon, in the castle. You find runes in the castle to find to uh upgrade yourself and this is the architect what he does is you only get 60 percent of your gold but he will however lock the castle in place because every time you go in the castle changes this is the chair on he takes your money to let you into the castle that's it that's pretty much everything in the game hope you guys have a fantastic day this is jesus gaming signing out and i will see you guys in the next one i think i'll be recording hearthstone after this and this one's probably going up tonight but anyway, I hope you guys have a fantastic day. This is Just Gaming signing out. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Do all the other stuff you usually do on YouTube. And um, I'll be seeing you when I be seeing you. Bye.